Hey guys, quick video here. Um, Alico 3, I'm going to do a video on how to show off this program, the Turbo Lister. This is a free program for anybody that has a PC. For a Mac, it does not work. I'm not sure why it does not work, but I've been using it for probably a little over two years now. And I'm really happy with it. The speed and fluidity of it is, uh, I haven't seen anything else like it to list items quickly on eBay. Um, I list three different types of sports in my store so I do baseball football and hockey so these are my templates so this is just what I uh, work off when I'm when I'm listing something so I would just go to my first template right and it'll pop up it should pop up so you have to click it more than once I don't know why it does that but okay there it is and it says um, this, this is what you type into your title, right? And let's say I want to set the auction off at a different price. So uh, we'll just go two point, I don't know, or two fifty, seven days. Select what you want for your days. Tens the pretty much the the way to do it now. And then when you go into edit, it, it already has it in there because it was it's in the template. But um, you just put like the 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 team and the and. Uh, attributes so it's an autograph it's numbered so I don't know it's, if it's technically a rookie but year and player so get done there you don't you don't have to you don't have to fill these out by the way item specifics it helps buyers uh, see your items so but, uh, the pictures already in there so shipping right here and so when you're all done with everything you got it all in line you don't have to mess with the description builder and put in the description the, t the title of the item because it's, it's already up here so I don't know why you need to post it twice but if you want to you can so you could uh, save an uh, item and then I always make two different folders so auctions and fixed price ones so this is an auction so you click in the auctions folder click OK there now what, what you just made went into that folder so that that's pretty cool so now you have all your auctions and fixed price cards separately if you want to start your auctions off at night say like 5 p.m. Pacific time or uh, you know which would be 8 Eastern 7 Central and then say you wanted to do a, a, another card let's do a football card so click on that so you got everything up right now right um, let's go down and pick the picture out find out which card we're, we're going to list this time so go down scroll down let's just say we're going to do this rice card it's kind of a cool looking card this is a canvas so insert them these are all scanned. I've been playing around with this uh, scanner lately. Uh, let's say you want to do free shipping. Click the free shipping box. Go up to the top. Type what your card is, obviously. It's a 2012. It's really hard to do this with the camera. Propped up. Jerry Rice. SP Authentic. Authentic Canvas Auto. Okay, and I'd, I actually just throw a team behind it too. I would probably list that a little differently if I wasn't filming it at the moment. So then let's just say you want to do a fixed price, okay, for this one. And I don't know, I'll just say $300. This is a pretty rare card. So, good tow cancel. You can do that. I usually do uh, 30 days if my quantity is less than like 5. Because then if it sells, it's just off your thing and you don't keep paying for it. So, item, item specifics again. Pop in there, change a few things up. Doesn't take long, so you just get used to it. Um, this is the year. I got these mixed up. Team. I would probably just do San Francisco. If you click this button, get uh, suggestions. It'll kind of put the teams in for you. They kind of just pop up. Era, you can just do modern. It doesn't really matter. But Jerry Rice, it pops up for you. Click it. It's not a rookie. It's an autograph. It's not numbered. Click done. Everything set up, free shipping, description builder, okay, it's ready, fix price it, click the fixed price category, boom, there you go, and as soon as you get going, you start to fly through these, you, you kind of know what you want to put and what stuff you want to put in different categories, so I just wanted to show, this is how I list my items, this is how I get stuff in the store quicker, uh, I've got like 3,500 items, and I'll, you know, I'll do like 50 or 100 at a time, after I break some boxes and stuff I don't want, I put together lots and just different things like that, so just a tip for guys at list um, it's a free download and if you like it it can be uh, really helpful guys so thanks a lot